You know, each year as football season comes to a close, we're accustomed to careers coming to a close. Players graduate and move on to bigger and better things. When it comes to coaches, though, turnover can be a little more difficult to accept. For the better part of the last three decades, Capital High head football coach Todd Simmis has been a fixture in our football community. They say all good things must come to an end. In this case, I personally chose to neglect that it ever would or could. For the last 11 falls, I have thoroughly enjoyed each and every encounter that I've had with Coach Simmis. In my heart of hearts, I know that he makes our football community better because he makes our kids better. He offers them an understanding that sacrifice, discipline, and determination can, relate, can lead to remarkable success. Just look at his football program. Knowing the inevitable would eventually kind of nudge right up to us and awkwardly stand there wishing we could push it away, Simmis promised me that when he felt it was time to move on from coaching football, he would let me know. This week, that text that I wanted to neglect finally arrived. I had to read it twice to make sure, and it was clear I could no longer pretend that the inevitable wouldn't happen. After this season, Todd Simmons is stepping down as the head coach at Capitol High School. So with that in mind, every time the Eagles hit the field on Friday night, they aren't just playing to prolong their season, they're playing to prolong their coach's remarkable career. To Donald Larson Park we go. Capital hosted Timberline this evening. Let's just say Gurkha had plenty of pride in this one. Racing out to a 35-0 lead, we pick it up here with Wade Zenner, finding Anthony Bridges for a nice gain. Zenner would then contribute with a little bit on the ground here. He decides to keep it himself, and he puts the Wolves down in the scoring position. Zenner would then finish off the drive with a touchdown pass to Garrett Lavin. Unfortunately, by the time we showed up to this game, Capital was up 35 to nothing, which means this game was out of hand, and all we have is a few Timberline highlights. Either way, Gurkha Pride marching on, and so is Coach Simmons. They win the night 42-7, the finals. 